What is going on guys, Gaming Incident here. In today's episode we are going to talk about breeding in Temtem. I was thinking a long time to try and make such an episode but I felt I wasn't ready yet. Now that I'm ready, let's see how I bred my first pukey with all the egg moves step by step. In case you are confused like I was at the beginning, no worries, just sit, grab a popcorn and relax. When you want to start breeding a Tem, these things are very important. Does the Tem you want to breed have egg moves? If so, how many and how can you obtain them? Let's see, Pukey has 3 egg moves, Flood, High Pressure Water and Revitalize. First two egg moves can be obtained by breeding with Calabis, since Calabis can learn both necessary egg moves. Also Calabis needs to be male, but we'll get to that later. Revitalize was Psy Park exclusive egg move for Pukey and cannot be learned by breeding, it can only be transferred from one Pukey to another. Ok, now that we know how to obtain the egg moves, next important thing is where to catch the temps. Yuki can be found in Siljaro river in Denise and on the second map in Omnimnesia in the pool. Calabis can be found in Tukma in Xalatl reservoir but only has 10% encounter rate. Now big brain move, instead of catching Calabis, you'll probably need decades to get enough with one perfect SP. You can catch Kalazu and evolve it, since its encounter rate is way higher in Siliaro River. After evolving, let's proceed on to the next step which is the actual breeding. When you're trying to breed Thames with egg moves, and this is very important thing to take care of, make sure you obtain all the necessary egg moves sooner rather than later. Trust me, it's gonna make the breeding process much easier for you. For me, this was the easiest way to get all the egg moves in the next two generations. We start with two branches for the different egg moves. On the first branch we pass the revitalize egg move and on the second branch we pass the other two egg moves. We breed the revitalize pukey with female pukey perfect SV in speed. Here is the product 6 fertility revitalize speed pukey. As for the second branch we breed male calabis with female pukey. Everything that can be passed onto the baby with one breeding. For example HP and stamina, attack and special attack or defense and special defense. The fact that we are using male Calabis is simple because the baby type is always determined by the female parent. In this scenario, the second generation already has all required egg moves. Let's see what we've got so far. Combine both of these to pass the egg moves. Now that we've made 3 SP product with all required egg moves, let's move on to the next branch. This is the easy breeding process, cause we don't need to worry about anything but passing the right SVs. We pair HP with stamina, attack with special attack or defense with special defense. After they hatch, we pair them with a single SV in speed. Now that we have attack, special attack and speed, we pair it with the egg move carrier in this situation, HP, stamina, speed. Yeah boy, look at that beautiful temp with 5 SV. And there we go. We have the first parent. HP, stamina, speed, attack and special attack. Let's move on to the second parent. Easy peasy guys, you know the drill. Now that we have the parent with everything ready, we need another one but with different stats. Because the first parent is missing defense, special defense, the second needs to be missing either one of these. HP, stamina or attack, special attack. Let's start breeding the second parent. For this breeding we also need two branches. For the first branch we pair attack with special attack and when it's done we pair it with speed. For the second branch we pair defense and special defense and when it's done we pair it also with speed. And now that we have both of these we pair it together and we got the final product. The second parent which has attack special attack, speed, defense and special defense. All we need to do is pair both of the parents and we have the final product. Flawless, 3 egg moves, 7 SV pukey. And that's it guys. We did it! Sit, relax and wait for it to hatch.
just a friendly reminder, there is a chance you'll get sucked somewhere throughout the process because of the gender lock. Nonetheless, you have two options, to rebreed from the very beginning, step by step, just to save fertility, or just to rebreed from the last step and you'd lose one's fertility. It's up to you. If you enjoyed this video, smash that like button and subscribe. If you like these types of episodes, leave a comment below. What do you think? Which them would you like to see in some of our new future step-by-step -step breeding guides? Hopefully, this was helpful. That's all for this episode. Happy pants on farming. Happy luma hunting. Drink your coffee. Drink your water. I'm out. No, really. Subscribe!